Hey what's guys, up? what's up? It's Playmat Format. Uh, set Booster. Set Booster of Zendikar Rising. We have... Booster Box Game. Yeah. Um, we had already gotten one of these. We're going to jump right into it because we started filming already and something got messed up. So, uh... Where's that? Nail and just go look at this. My nail doesn't do shit, man. I meant your actual nail. I did. That one's way bigger. Oh. There. Anyways. We got this box open. Destroyed the box. Oh, um, <laughs> yeah. My bad. Um. Okay. We each get 12 packs and... Oh yeah, there's only 24 in these, huh? We each get 12 packs. I'm just gonna separate it like this because it doesn't matter because it's a booster box game. But it's really cool anyways because... Um, $140 each one of these, for this box. Uh, sure, you only get 24 packs, but there's... Um, there's a chance to pull really, really good cards out of them. And there's only 12 cards in every old, old pack. set card. And there's a box topper. Yeah, and there's a box topper. We'll save that for last, guys. Like most people. But, uh, yeah, the packs are falling over. Alright, separated. And we got a Zendikar Rising Expedition box topper, which will be. Last. Yes. Oh, yeah. Alright. Holy crap. That's a lot. Alright, I'll start. Um. Do you got TCG yeah. up? TCG player. Go ahead and keep opening I'll get it open. Alright. Yeah. yeah. It's just right there. Alright. Alright. Open it up. Uh, do you go somewhere specific? Certain list? Or do you just go to No, I just scan them. Okay. That's fine. Uh, oh, you clear the list. Clear okay. list. Um, I got in our card, of course, it's not a signed one. Um, this cool forest. Everybody likes cool forests. Everybody likes cool forests. And then commons. Skip into commons. Commons. And then. Come on, Sleeveworthy. Uh, a common showcase art. That's cool. Um, okay. Uh, this, why am I showing commons? Um, I got a Mythic Already Scourge of the Skyclaves. It is. Two. It costs two to bring out. It's one colorless, one black. Uh, kicker for four, five, six. When you cast this spell, if it was kicked, each player loses half their life rounded up. Ooh. Scourge of the Skyclaves, power and toughness are each equal to 20 minus the highest life <laughs> total among players. Hey, I remember getting this one out of, uh, this is, uh, the one I got out of my booster box. 1068. 1068. Money, 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 money. Money, money, so, money, money, money. Uh, we'll cool sleeve. sleeve. We bought these sleeves so long ago, and I had never sleeve used them him because up. you only we'll get any of them. just put the money cards in the middle. How about that? Guys? Yeah, there we go. Money cards go in the um, I know this rare isn't worth nothing. I got a Taju Paragon, but I will have him bring that up. It's a booster box game. Oh, that's not the right one. No, is it? That's promo pet. That's just the normal Zen Pro Rising. 19, 19 cents. cents. Not really worth anything. I'll put it over here. And then my foil is Deliberate. Common. Common. Yeah, you never know if there actually is a common foil. Expensive <coughs> card, fourteen cents. Yeah, really. So nope. So I'll just put this in the common pile. Boo 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 boo. Oh, 
Um, hey, just leave. Actually, it's a money card. Land and arts can go together. Land, arts, and tokens can go together. And I will just switch this around. And there you go, guys. Oh, am I supposed to f put these at the bottom? What? Oh, uh, I art see. Cards. Go first. Go first. It's not a signed one. Guys, so we pulled a, uh, a signed art card last night. See if you could find that. Show it to them. It was a $15 card. It was awesome. An Omnith signed art card last night. And then we turned around today, went and bought um, some packs. Some and pulled an on packs and pulled an on We turned around and sold that right away. Yeah. Um. But what we did get ooh, get to keep. The gate. That's yeah. What we did get to keep was a turn timber symbiote foil alternate art. Yes. Fifteen bucks. Huh? All right. So Merfolk Falconer, my first uncommon. Oh, you don't need to show them, it's just the rare and the mythic. Oh, okay, we're going like that. Yeah, make it go a little <sighs> faster. Uh, Needle Verge Pathway and Pilverage Pathway. Pilverage Pathway, the flipper, one of the flipper lands. These got super common super fast. Nice. And Oh, that's Two, one of the better ones. 256 we'll use. Yep, Penny Sleeve will work penny just fine. Two fifty six foil. We've pinging the foils anyways. Yeah, just just because. And then I got an illusion case. token. Cause we gotta try and make the four hundred I mean a hundred and forty dollars back to get a booster box, right? Yeah. Oh god. Uh, no, that's nope, not worth messing. Alright, next pack guys. Uh uh you could just go in the Common pile over there. Yeah. Money cards will go right here. Everything else will just go. Well, yeah, I'm going to put them up here still in your stack. Just anything. Anything worth anything, and then we'll show them off at the end. Uh, Another cool art card. I will show the arts. They're kind of cool. Oh, I love the art cards. Um, Cool force. Uh, Island, whatever. Land. Land. Yeah. Um, wow. I got a lot of uncommons in this pack. Um, anyways. We don't own any rights to the song playing in the background repeatedly, apparently. Or any other songs. I know, I know. Uh, the rare I got was Zenith. Or any other. Sam the Trickster. So far, none of those older set cards. Oh my god, haven't we pulled like. Isn't that like our eighth one of those? Freaking. It was 80 something cents last we looked. Uh, 47 cents. Wow, already went down. Oh, well, mine was the foil one. That's why it was worse. So much. Get rid of all those weak sass. Uh, no, I mean, when I first pulled one of those, it was like 87 cents. Just a regular I'm not one. even going to bother it. But it's cool for me. It looks like we're getting Jude on this box, bro. So far. So far. <coughs> we're doing a booster box game with this? Yep. So far, we're at $13.22, guys. What do we need this to get to? 140 this is a zoning, this is what's gonna get us most of that money back. Omnith. So hopefully it's the Omnith. Do you got an Omnith? Oh, I don't know yet. Um, I got this cool flamey art card. It's cool. I like that. <coughs> Not signed though. Uh, planes skip the commons. The cons are really cool though. Uh, Sorry, I got a cold. Wind Rider Wizard. It's pretty cool. Kazool's Fury. That's cool. Uh, That's and Kazool's Cliff. <laughs> uh, more commons. Ugh. Damn it. Akaza. 
for my rare. Cousin. Gotten a couple of these already. <gasps> oh. You got a good one, so I was like. I gotta feed the swarm foil. It's a foil. Causes in the 18 cents. Well. So, remove Kaza. So, that's my foil. So, feed the swarm sorcery. It's gonna be like that, huh? Feed the swarm. Feed the swarm. And it is foil. 98 cents. It doesn't reach the dollar zone. Oh, cool. So you can. That's an uncommon. So I'll just put it in. So far. Then I got a Hell's Thunder from a whole different set. Ooh. Yeah. That's a really cool card. Um, it has flying haste at the end of turn, sacrifice Hell's Thunder. And then, and then unearth. But you can only do that once. Uh, yeah, but if you uh, don't do the unearth, if you put in a red black. Yeah, 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 yeah. Recursion. It's a four. It's a three drop. List four card. Four. Our first list card doesn't even make two dollars. Wow. So that is your list awesome. Card. Oh. Uh, we only count a dollar and up, guys. Yeah, that's what we've been doing. So, if we lose out on some money, then... Yeah. Oh, well. But then we get cool decks. Um, I'm still working on This art card's pretty cool. Let's see here. Swamp. Some commons. Uncommons. More commons. Uh, commons, uncommons, and then I've got a Skyclave Apparition. Ooh. Let's see what Skyclave Apparition brings us in the money. It was quite a bit of money at one point. Remove it off of. Okay, black. There it goes. Seven dollars and sixty nine. See, I cents. told ya. So you deserve a hard sleeve. Yep. Yep. Five dollars or more always deserves a hard sleeve. Hard sleeve for you. And you will and you go still have more, in huh? the money pile and a lamb foil. Lamb foil. And a token. It's just a human name. I don't really care, so token can go over there. Oh, this was... So, they brought back the word mill in actual text. That's one thing that I love about this set. They actually say mill instead of target opponent. Puts the top two cards of their library into the graveyard. Why don't you just shorten the text and say mill? It's what everybody else says. It's pretty much a side ability. They finally did it. Uh, we are getting a Commander Legends box. It just might take a, a little longer than planes expected. Creature, creature, so. creature. Um, Sound good? Well, I'm, I'm, I'm good? We'll see. Alright, uh, <coughs> cool little prowling Philidar, but it's just a common. Uh, then a Spoils of Adventure. It's pretty cool. I'm, I'm not really big on the whole party thing. Um, a Journey to Oblivion. Uh, I love these kind of cards. This is a bit high costing, costing though. It's five yeah. to exile something. Um, then a Vine Gecko. And then an Inscription of a... Abundance for my rare. This is a cool little uh, kicker for one green and two. Choose one if the spell was kicked. Choose any number instead. Put two one one counters on target creature. Target player gains X life where X is the greatest power among creatures they control. Ooh. Target creature you control fights target creature you don't control. And then this. 
cool little foil chilling trip. That's pretty cool. Thirty-two cents for your. Uh, Does I get to keep it? I don't even know why we're even looking at these uh, foils. I'm not gonna screw it. it. Unless it's like a foil mythic or rare, we're not gonna. Well, I'm, I'm glad a lot of these sets have been coming out with a lot of foils, because I really want to make an all foil deck. Yeah, that'd be cool. Uh, Skydiver Dude. Foil. Mountain. Oh, it's scary like that. Um, foil Omnith Art Card. No. I need Commons. I wonder if that art card, that Omnith art card comes in foil. Okay. And I think I got another Junker. Um, Throne of McKendy. Uh, you can tap it for generic energy. Mana. Mana. Yeah, mana, mana. Uh, tap one mana to tap it. Put a charge counter on Throne of McKendy. Uh, tap it, remove a charge counter from Throne of McKendy, add two mana of any color, one color, spend this mana only to cast kick spells. <coughs> you don't have your ping on? 16 cents. Wow. So, so far we're getting destroyed. Do you have more? And I'm not even going to bother. I haven't been looking up the uncommons like I started to. I mean, the commons and the uncommon foils, because not one of them is over a buck. Yeah. At this I point, I think we should have been give up. smart and just. Well, this mountain might be over a buck to somebody. I like the card shop, so I might take that into the card shop. Then. Yeah. But. It's a cool little art card. Art card! I love art cards. It is not foil art card. It's not signed, signed or anything. Art card, yeah. uh, forest! Foil forest! I'm getting a lot of these McKinney oxes. Yeah. Not really. Okay. You're gonna read off Oof, every duh. uncommon to. Uh, you know what? I don't think so. I think I'm going to skip all my uncommons. Um, that's <laughs> really cool. I got a really cool one again. Um, I got a mythic. <coughs> Angel of Destiny. It's a flying double strike whenever a creature you control does combat damage to a player. You and that player each gain that much life. At the beginning of your end step, you have at least 15 life more than your starting life total. Each player... Angel of Destiny attack this turn loses the game. Yeah, that's cool. Dude. Wow. But banned probably. <sighs> yeah. On white. Just doesn't want to ping on white. <sighs> to, Why does it want to ping? I hate trying to ping white cards. It's always a pain in the butt. Oh. Just. Oops, forgot to ask. Just. Regular Angel of Destiny three twenty eight. Uh, then a sneaking guide foil goblin. I'm almost certain that's not worth anything, so I don't think we're gonna bother. No. Then a tree of <laughs> tales from. What's the dagger one? Is that a Kamigawa? I have no idea. Uh, so this land. It's an artifact land. It's a green artifact land. Sweet. And it's a list card. Ooh. Wait. 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 What? Hit what is that? And it's the Plains list chase. 182. 182. What set was that? Uh, if you go back. Hold on. And it's was from that? Meridian. I loved Meridian. But Money this card. is the list card, so it gets a penny sleeve. 
And it goes in the pile. And it goes into the money card pile. So far, what we got is twenty-six dollars. We're going Not very terrible. slow on this box, guys. Our mythics so far haven't been the greatest hits. No, they haven't, but that's okay. Hopefully, there's a good box stopper though. Uh, we got a vampire dude for that forest. Uncommon, 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 common, common. Alright. And a foil common. Just show it to you guys. It's a foil ultimate or common. Um we got a Nighthawk scavenger. Ooh. Ooh. Nighthawk scavenger. I like Nighthawk Scavenger. Oh my favorite. Two seventy two penny sleeve it is. That's not bad. It isn't for that guy. We we've been getting a lot of those good two and to then three down cards. Root runner for my list card. Ooh. That's a Kamigawa. Yeah. Uh pay two green sacrifice root runner put target land on top of its owner's library. Soul Shift 3. When Ooh. this is put into a graveyard from play, you may return target spirit card with converted mana cost 3 or less from the graveyard to your hand. Yeah, dude. I never even heard of That's in Soul under. Shift. Really? Yeah, I haven't played in that set. Uh, Root Runner List Card. It, 250? 250 for that. That's not bad. So another penny sleeve. Alright. $5 and up, we'll get a hard sleeve. Because we're running out of hard sleeves. Copy! Copy, 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 copy. <laughs> I need to stop doing that. Oh. That sucks. Alright. Um. So I'll instantly put those there. Some kind of cool foil, I mean, fire art. Yeah, that's really cool. Cool fire. Boop, 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 boop. Let's skip all the commons. And uncommons. Go straight to the rares and whatever. Oh, we're skipping the uncommons too, that's right. So, I got a river glide pathway. Sweet. Is it foil? No, unfortunately. Oh, that would have been nice. I probably what? should have shown my uncommons. Three sixty-five. Not bad, not bad. Sweet. And then a foil uh, shell shield. It's foil, so. Yeah, I haven't been looking up the uncommon common foils. Oh, okay. So. I, I just stopped doing that because it takes are. forever. I like the copies. Most of the copies are cheap. <laughs> I wonder if that token is worth anything. <laughs> token! Is it gonna read the token? Probably not. It doesn't want to read the token. Oh, try this. <laughs> what? Just. F oh, I hit the shop button on Shop it, button, so. yeah. It doesn't want to read the Screw. token. Yeah. Uh, cool art card, though. Oh wait, this is your copy, isn't it? No, that's your copy. <coughs> I just wanted to see if the copy was worth anything. Yeah. Commons. Uncommons. More commons. And then a Valakute Awakening. Ooh. This is my rare. It turns into a Valakute Stormforge. So we'll see. Come on, big money. money, money. Two twenty. Good enough. We're slowly creeping our way up to where we need to be. Slowly. Uh, foil uncommon. And token. Don't really care about token. Ah, I should be putting up tokens. Over here instead of in the garbage pile. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> Alright, you done with your pack? Yeah, I'm done with my pack.
My pack didn't really have much in it. Okay, garbage. Oh, dang it. <coughs> oh, that's cool. Cool. Cool little art card. Planes, common, 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 commonly. Common, common. There we go. Do that. Common, common, uh, uncommon, uncommon. I'll show that one off. That one's pretty cool. Uh, Scion of the Swarm. Actually, I think that was a rare a long, long time ago. A long time ago. A long probably. time ago. Flying when you gain life, put a 1 1 counter on Scion of the Swarm. That was, like, a big deal. Um. I got a mythic. Cool. Lithoform engine. Sweet. Yes, uh, lithoform engine for four is a legendary artifact where you can <laughs> through, tap it. Copy target art activated or triggered ability you control. You may choose new targets for the copy. Tap three, tap it. Copy target insert search spell you control. You may choose new targets for the copy. <coughs> tap four, copy target permanent spell you control. The copy becomes a token. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. That one That's is probably, probably going to be a good ping. Yeah, twelve ninety yeah, thirty nine. Hell yeah, that's a hard sleeve worth it. A uh, tormenting sleeve. voice for a foil. I don't think that's gonna be worth it. And then a Merfolk Mist Binder. Other Merfolks you control get plus one plus one. Oh, uh, list card. That's a list card Ixalan. Yep, Ixalan. Oh, hold on. Hang on. Uh, no, it's not. It's Rivals, Rivals of the Dollar ninety one. Alright. Money is money. Money is money. It's over a buck. It goes into the money pile. Alright, my turn. We're actually almost out of Betty Pays over. Oh, she wants to play with packs. You can let her play with packs with that. A couple of ruined packs. Do you want. <coughs> you want me to open this? These are hot. Um. <laughs> this one. Uh, land, and then a bunch of commons, and then uh, yeah, a bunch of commons. Get the commons out of the way. So many commons this time. What the hell? Uh, that's also a common. So I'll put those there. The one uncommon this time, and I got a archon of. Ameria. Ooh. Which is this guy. That's just a rare, isn't it? Yeah. Just regular rare. He was also a mythic at one point. 66 cents does not break the dollar wow. point, so that goes there. That was wow. <laughs> well, so far, this one's been garbage. So far, yeah. Oh, oh, There's a lot of cool stuff, but it's just not it's not what we're looking for, man. <sighs> this better save us right here. Oh I sure hope so. Oh, we get a fetch land out of there or um, a cavern of souls or some shit like that. <laughs> uh Kazandu Nectropot is my foil. I'm just gonna go ahead and do that. <laughs> Get that out of the way. Uh, Relic Vial. I really like Relic Vial. It's a cool card. Uh, Salundi Vision. A Demon's Disciple. Yep, yep, yep. And then a Kazandu Mammoth, which is also a Kazandu Valley for my rare. And it's, uh, Extended Art? Extended Art. Yeah. Yes. Uh, extended art Kazandu. Is that the extended art one? Why is I'm I'm betting it's that middle one. Cause it, well, that's the original. Oh. Wow. <coughs> well, that sucks. There it is, right there. Yeah. Yeah, it's not worth nothing. Yeah, and then in Aura Skyclave, Hierophant, a legendary 
uh, creature core cleric. Whenever it or another cleric you control dies, you turn cleric card with lesser converted mana cost from your graveyard to the battlefield. A yeah, black I have and a white. Bunch of those. That is a good commander. If you're I already a have him as a commander. 17 cents. My turn to build a commander. <laughs> Shoot, I'm gonna put him on our least I know. Uh, we might need those. So. Yeah, that's true. Uh, you got. Oh, I have a whole bunch more. A whole bunch more, and uh, uh, so far no signed art, but I did get this cool art. It's kind of cool. Uh, of course, an island. God, I got enough of these guys to freaking build four, six. Build two of these decks and still have some to put in my already red and blue decks or red, blue, black decks. Okay, commons, uncommons. So we're not showing everything right now. He's kind of got a time. But here's a red card. It's called Nahiri's Litho for me. Sacrifice X lands for each land sacrifice this way. Draw a card. You may play X additional lands this turn. Lands you control. Enter the battlefield cap this turn. It's a good card, though. It is a good card. Great card. I mean, if we added up all the cents with it, I'm pretty sure we'd win, but that's not how we do the booster box game. I got a signed <laughs> art card! Signed art! Signed art! Signed art, guys. It's really cool. It's uh, Canopy Balif by Philip Bourbon. It's seven, the 70th out of 81. Wow. That's so cool. All right. Signed wow. Art. You might have to put it on. What? No, that's the one. Four dollars. All right. Gold stamp. Worth it. So awesome. Hard. 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 Well, any uh, of the signed art ones, I say we do a sleeve. Do a hard sleeve. Hard sleeve for that guy. Especially with us running out of sleep at this point. <coughs> That's why I was doing everything over like a dollar. Because not everything is over a dollar anymore. Okay. So I got a Goma Fata Vanguard. Thundering Spark Mage. Joe's forgetting we're not doing uncommon. Oh, yeah. Ravager's Mace. Sejiri Shelter. Another inscription of abundance. Oh, I thought that was. I thought this one was. What? No. That's not the right one. No, not promo pack. So thirty-two cents. Not worth my head. Uh, practice tactics. And that's it. Yep. All right. Next card pack, guys. Mm, this box wasn't as good as this box. So far. No. That's still cool. That's though. cool. Yeah. I uh, like how this books. Yeah. No, rocks. But it's not signed. Uh skipping those. Skipping these. Yeah, I need to remember to skip. Skipping that. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Skipping that. Token. And the Hierophant, we already looked him up. He was only 17 cents. And then Lotus Cobra. Oh. So A lot of people are taking Lotus Cobra, actually, we found out today. People really Showcase like it. Showcase Lotus Cobra, $2.00. And 62 cents. And 62 cents. Not bad. The, uh, the guy at the card shop took, like, what, three of them from you? Yeah. He really wanted those cards. They used to be, like, five bucks, but not more. Well, I can see why. Everybody, are you kidding me? We haven't pulled a single, uh, there hasn't been a single one where we haven't pulled. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. But still, uh... 
guys go over there. <coughs> There. Let's go right there. Let's go right there. A uh, inscription of ruin. Two. Whoa. Um. Uh. Seventeen six. A a foil Umara mystic. It's so, uh, uncommon. Yeah. Why that one's not even A full art, imperious perfect. That is a beautiful card. I wish it was foil. What the hell? Yeah. Dude. Yeah. How oh, cool. I wish. It's a list card, isn't it? Yeah. I have to find the list. Five. Five dollars and twenty eight cents. Yeah. yeah, it gets a hard kiss. Yeah. That is cool. I like L's, man. You lucky bastard. I really, yeah, that was, that's cool. Yeah. All right, my turn. Uh, we're at sixty three dollars and ninety four cents on the booster box game. I will try and go faster. I mean, try and uh, <laughs> see if we can't get a, another box. Uh. Uh. Okay. See if it, I got a Zenith Sand the Tricks. Another Zenith Zan the Trickster. Um, normal 47 cents. So he comes off the list. Um, rolling yeah. Vortex. <laughs> Roiling Vortex. Come on. Come on, Orange. Yeah. Don't do this, Orange. There we go. 21 cents. Wow. Not really worth anything. And then a foil wow. Wayward yeah. Guide Beast. What did I miss? Not much. I didn't really find it. Any wow. more pennies? <laughs> It must be out of penny seeds or something. Foil. Even Pokemon sleeves work. Uh, not worth nothing. Oh, it's my Not turn. worth nothing. All of those no. were not worth nothing. They're both of them? But you did find a bunch of these, so that's good. Yeah, I found a bunch of those. It's not like we're actually pulling anything oh. deliciously delicious right now. Right? Wow. Uh, except for that. That was cool. That was good. I really uh, like that. Other elf creatures you control get <laughs> plus one, plus one. Tap one green and tap it. Put a one, one green elf warrior creature token into play. Why isn't that, like, just a basic command? Right? That would be dumb. That would be a really cool one. Hey, look at that. <laughs> I would, oh, man. I wish that was a signed card. I might have looked that one up just because. It's uh, Nissa. It's uh, the Nissa Urquhart. Nissa of Shadowed Bows by David Raposa. David Raposa, thank you. For such beautiful art. My Liliana is having a lot of fun. Uh, okay. no, it, it's not no, the it's card. not the actual card. Is that what the actual card looks like? It, it must be. Not the signed art card. Sixty-seven cents. So yep. that's cool, but it's mountain. <coughs> not worth anything. Sixty-seven cents. <coughs> Okay. The list sounds like crap. Hagra Mauling. Coo, coo, coo. <laughs> Let's see. Let's see. Come on. 70, 
three cents. Ugh. This sucks. In Antisognation? It's uh, my foil. Just uh, comment out there. Yeah. Um, Arcbound Slith. Arcbound Slith is a two drop artifact creature Slith. Whenever it deals damage to a player, put a one more counter on it. And it has modular one, and it's a zero zero. Uh, for those that don't know, modular one. This comes into play with a one one counter on it. When it's put into a graveyard, you may put its one one counters on target artifact creature. That's a cool card. Nothing. No, that's not. Be. Oh yeah, it's got to be the list card, huh? The list. One dollar and fifty seven cents. What were you just saying? Nice. Getting all like all the weak sauce list cards except for that five dollar one. Oh yeah, that was a good one. <laughs> like the last time we got an eight dollar and a nine dollar. I got a regular Omnith oh, art card. Oh, yeah. Foil Forest, um, some commons, uncommons, more commons, and then we got ourselves a clear water pathway. Four dollar clear water pathway that I think will deserve a thief. <coughs> clear water pathway, and then I got a foil legion angel. Thirty-eight cents. Not worth nothing. Foil, Angel. So far, foils are correct. Yeah. All of these cards so far are the money cards. We're doing okay with money cards, but we literally only got two mythics. My turn. Yeah. So far, only two, two mythics. Yeah. Mythics. Three mythics. Three mythics. Oh, three mythics. Our bad. Hopefully, we get oh, at least so one cool. more mythic. Or why can't you be signed? That's what. I said. Oh, it's the mirror mage. Yeah. Oh, such a cool card. I you love this one. Dude, you're getting the cool art. I know. It's actually kind of cool. Actually, you want to. Oh, no. Might as well. Sixty-seven cents. It's not terrible for an art card. That's not signed. Right. Oh, um. Uncommons. Uncommons. And then Nimble Trap Finder. Nimble Trap Finder. Shadows of Verdict. Shadows of Verdict. What the hell? Come on, Shadows of What are you doing? Oh. No, I didn't read those, but at oh. this point, I don't think we need to. No. Uh, then a cleansing wildfire for a foil. It's just really cool art. That's all I'm going to show off of it. It's a common. Oh, no. No, I don't. Okay. Uh, Spring Jack Shepherd from, I don't know what set that is. Oh, it's a list card. Cool. It's a list card. Yeah. It's a uh, Kifkin wizard. Oh wow! Uh, it has chroma. When it comes into play, put a zero one white goat creature token into play for each white mana symbol in the mana cost of permanence you control. That's Ooh. cool. 
Has to be the mana cost, though. Uh, let's go in here. That's evening tide, and that's evening tide. Yeah, we don't even have it on the list. That's weird. I have, have the mystery booster, which is in a. So I don't know. Well, I'm gonna put it up there just in case it shows up. So I don't know. Your turn. All right. All right. We'd say eight packs left, guys, and then this video is done. Yeah. We'll tell you at the end. We got another one of those fellas, guys. If we won, which we will find out if that, because it looks like we're gonna be banking on. Uh, that expedition to pull us out of the hole. Um, I got a Tabarax Hope's Demise Demon Cleric. Ooh, is that a legendary creature? <laughs> yes. Tabarax Hope's Demise has lifelink as long as it has five or more plus one plus one counters on it. Whenever another non-token creature yeah. you control dies, put a plus one plus one counter mm -hmm. counter on Tabarax. If that creature was a cleric, you may draw a card. If you do, lose one life. Make a demon cleric deck. Yeah. Uh, Twenty-four cents. Sweet. Oh. Oh, here comes a New commander. fucking <laughs> awesome demon cleric deck. <laughs> Give him a second. He's worth <sighs> getting the commons and the common stuff doesn't take so long because I gotta get home here pretty soon. <sighs> Mirror Mage again. Yeah, I don't live here, guys. Just saying. Boop, boop. Zandu. If I did, that'd be cool, but no, I don't live here. Oh, you fucking assholes. Uh, Craig Plate Balleth? I'm not even gonna bother me looking at it. Really? Have we already yeah, looked it up? It's like 10 cents. Risen Riptide. It's just a. Oh, I guess it is a rare, guys. 18 Ooh. cents. It went up 8 cents. Ooh. Your turn. <laughs> um. Our card? Forced. It's uh, this. Uncommon. It's just a very popular. Common, common. Disgusting. More uncommons. And then I got an inscription of insight, guys. Okay. It's the blue inscription instead of the green one. And the black one, we finally got a different inscription. Oh, really? <laughs> blue inscription. Uh, kicker. Two and two blue. Choose one. If this spell was kicked, choose any number instead. Return up to two target creatures to their owner's hand. Scry two, then draw two cards. Target player creates an XX blue illusion creature token where X is the number of cards in your hand. Ah, oh, it didn't matter. Let it ping it twice. No. I did? I did? Tried to make sure it was worth some guys. And it didn't. Matter. It's not. It's just not. <coughs> oh. oh, wow. Um, A lot of uncommons. Here's my uh, common. Oh. That was one of my only uncommons. Okay, or commons. commons. Go away, young commons. And then I got a, a Kirky Fearless Voyager Legendary Creature Core Warrior. When you attack with 
A player with one or more equipped creatures draw a card. You may unattach an equipment from a creature you control. If you do, tap that creature, it gains indestructible until end of turn. That's a really cool uh, equipment nice. commander. Yes, that is... Yes, and then uh, Dauntless Survivor Thank you for a foil. I don't think he's worth anything, so. We're down to our last two packs each, and then it is box topper time. And then we'll let you know if we won this booster box game. Hopefully that is a very good box topper, unless we start pulling some mythics, guys. Um, there's this guy. An accidental Liliana from Mom and Kent. <laughs> <laughs> this guy. Oh, yeah? Oh. Yeah, am I talking uncommon. about you? Uncommon, uncommon, uncommon. Uh. Uh, Crawling Barons, which is a worthless rare, I believe. Yes, I was right. Worthless rare. A Grok Maw Skyclave Ravager, which is, I believe, another worthless rare. Yes, worthless rare. And then, this card. Which I think Joe wanted to keep these cards. Yes, I want to keep these because uh, there's they like little mini mini, mini magic games that I want to start putting together so we can start doing some new stuff on the channel. My turn. Under a last pass. Come on, Mythic. Come on, Mythic. Ah. Foily Alt Art Mythic. Foily Alt Art Omnith. Again. Again. <laughs> that was yeah. awesome. I was like, oh, I can't believe we didn't pull that on the channel. Nobody's going to believe us. You no. could talk to the card shop owner of Oracles. We sold it to him. Yep. Uh, <coughs> he's still one of the best card shop owners ever. Oh, yeah. He got to make money. We got to make money. We get it. And his boxes are cheap, like on the Card Kingdom. This box is literally 150. We got him 140. Ten dollars cheaper. Ten dollars. There is all the split current. Two. It is one blue, one green, and X, a legendary creature serpent. It enters the battlefield with a one-one counter on it for each mana spent to cast it. Whenever you cast a kick spell, you may remove two counters, two one-one counters from ver. Verizal, if you do copy that spell, you may choose new targets for it. That's yeah. cool. And 17 cents. Wow. So you could go there. Uh, veteran Adventure, it is a creature human that is also a cleric, rogue, warrior, and wizard. And it costs one less for each creature in your party. Vigilance. That's cool. Yeah. Yeah, so it's one, two, three, four. If you five, were building a party room. deck, but I'm pretty sure party decks are not in void nowadays. <coughs> yeah. Um, actually, I got a pretty cool art card. I got Nihari. That is pretty all cool. dark. Uh, Island. Box top. I'm so excited. I am too. Hopefully, it's something dope. <laughs> Because we are way behind. Uh, really? That's my list card? I'm disappointed in this box. I got a Skyder, Scatter Skull Charger. Woo! Scatter Skull Charger. Yay! <laughs> 16 cents. Woo! Yeah, so good. So much money. Okay. Uh, <laughs> right. That could go there. And my list card is a Pouncing Shore Shark from Ikoria. Ikoria. It's not even old. Why is that a fucking list card? Because it was popular, I guess. 
Wow. This is wow. This character. Ooh, 131. 31. I guess he gets a penny sleeve at least. Yeah. And it made pennies. us go up to 70 bucks, man. I can't believe that's actually yeah, worth oh, anything. Right. That is sad. When it's your so list sad. card is from Icoria. A whole nother set. Not even. A oh, oh man. Cool arcade, yeah, I'll go ahead and show that. It's uh, that's uh, one of the Nighthawks, isn't it? Yeah. That's one of my favorites. We're gonna take these uh, art cards that aren't worth anything and make a background. Yes. It's gonna be dope. Archpriest of Iona, human cleric. Its power is equal to the number of creatures in my party. At the beginning of combat on my turn, if I have a full party, target creature gets plus one plus one and gains flying until end of turn. Oh, it's a white card. Oh, wow. 15 cents. Synchronized spellcraft. Is it rare? No. A list card? No. Alright, guys. Hopefully, this saves us. Box Topper. Box Topper. Zendikar Rising Expedition Box Topper. It needs to be like a $50 card. I do not like it when it doesn't have the pull tag because I don't want to bend the card opening. I'll just destroy this pack. No, I worth. don't even care. It's not worth hurting the beautifulness inside Ancient Tomb. Oh, we got an Ancient Tomb. I don't want to get rid of it, but we have to. Ho, oh, ho, ho. Finally, a good card. Ooh. 35 bucks. Oh. It didn't get us there. It didn't get us there, but I'm pretty sure we will go back to one of these boxes eventually. Oh. But, um, the next box, because we did not win the booster box game. We gotta go back. We're gonna go to, um... The one that we still have to do, right? No, we're going to go to uh, Commander Legends. We're going to get a Commander Legends box because it comes out on the 20th. we got to open up a new box. Yeah. Well, that's the but, days away. Yeah, but by the time we get the money back and we send out money to get the box. Yeah, true. Well, guys, uh, we actually had a pretty decent box topper. That yeah, awesome. that was cool. Last Pretty time it was only card. like 10 bucks, but we had like 10 <laughs> mythics. This time we only got three mythics and pulled an ancient tomb. Anyways, guys, that was the booster box game for the set boosters. Um, this was playmat format. We will get another booster box game going from now on when there's openings. It's always going to be booster box game. Until we start making more money at our jobs. Yeah, we are not making enough to pretty much get the cards that we need. So anytime that we have cards and we need to sell them as soon as we can. So that they're worth something. Yes. So uh, so we can have more openings for you guys. You guys sure like the openings. Um, and Next we, opening I think might be Pokemon. We did a Yu-Gi-Oh! We did a Magic. Yes, it will be a Pokemon we'll be doing a opening. Pokemon opening. It might be dollar store packs, because that might be all we have for. Uh, that will be next week, because we get paid soon. Yeah. So, stay tuned for dollar store pack Pokemon opening sometime. Either in the middle of this week, or next week. Alright, have a good <laughs> night, guys. All of us from Play Mat Format want you to have a good night, have a safe time, and don't get too drunk. It's still the weekend. Yeah. <laughs> All right, don't guys. be too upset about you know. We lost, losing. 
We losing. Lost. We lost. All right, have a good night.